Didn't expect to be seeing a hel helicopter drop off a, uh, maybe an HVAC unit. City living, I guess, huh? Well guys, we got another fun day of feasting for the uh, Lakeview Chamber of Commerce. Today they're sending me out to find the best fish joints in the area. You know, with Lent and all, people are about to be slamming some fried fish. So I'm hitting up three fantastic spots. Let's cruise to the first spot now. All right, guys, we're at our first spot, Wilds. You guys know how much of a book lover I am. You guys are gonna love this place. I mean, I'm obsessed with it. Uh, let's go check it out. Fish sandwich out. Come on, look how good that looks. We got the pretzel bun, we got lettuce, we got cheese, we got some tomato on there. This is just a great looking, but that, that's unbelievable. And I got a lot to say about this place. I am a huge Wilds fan, and not just that it's literally at the end of my street. Like, hold on. This is literally the street I live on, so. It's kind of the easiest. But it's, I mean, it's just so close. I love it. Uh, but yeah, we gotta try this before I get into why Wilds is so awesome. Mmm. Mmm, 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 mmm. God, this is so good. Oh yeah, tartar sauce on here too. It's so crispy, so delicious. I mean, I've tried it before. Fry anything up, I'm gonna love it. I'm not even a huge fish guy. This is delicious. This might be my favorite one in the city. That's really good. Okay, so a few of the reasons why I'm obsessed with Wild. One, you guys know how big of a reader I am. It's based off of Oscar Wilde, so they're based off him. I mean, it's inspired by it. You can find porches of them all over the place. There's also like a little library nook here, which obviously I think is the coolest thing ever. And we've got two bars, they're fantastic. Like, I don't know, just that old school, like I consider like English wood grain bars. I don't really know how to describe it. It's awesome. I mean, even the stained glass like ceiling light is wonderful. They've got two fireplaces. This is just one of the most like, I don't know, classy, awesome places to go to. And on top of that, this is that strip of Broadway I've talked about a ton of times. There's just so much cool stuff in this area. Some of my favorite bars like Dram and Muse right down the street, Laugh Factory's right down the street. A lot of my favorite restaurants are right around here. It's just a very, it's just a really high energy neighborhood, which is why I love living here. And then on top of that, you can get one of the best fish sandwiches I've had. Mm. Guys, this is so good. And I know I've said this in other like Lakeview Chamber of Commerce videos, but if you could go and comment on the like the vertical reels I'm making on Instagram for them, I mean, follow Lake, Lakeview Chamber of Commerce. It's so awesome that they're hiring creators that they think are making cool stuff to come and like help them make content. Okay guys, I've still got two more fish meals to eat. I shouldn't finish this. I'm gonna be so stuffed by the end of this video. I'm gonna wrap it up. We're gonna cruise to our next spot. Next we're going to, down the street to one of the best fish joints in the city, Duke of Perth. I had to do one more bite. All right, let's cruise. Alright guys, we're at the second spot, Duke of Perth. This place is famous for their fish. I'm excited to show it to you guys. Let's go. Thank you. 
Check that out. We've got a pretty traditional fish and chips move going on here. Oh, also, Tenet's beer. Scottish beer for a Scottish bar. Oh, that's tasty. Yeah, I need to get into this. Yeah, big old cup of tartar sauce. Mmm, mmm, mmm. This is fire. Did you guys hear that crunch? Oh my god. Mm. We got Alaskan Pollock, and it's all you can eat every Wednesday and Friday a whole year. A great bar, super cool. Really like, I mean, it's a Scottish bar, and they really fed into the Scottish vibe. I think it's awesome. Right, here's how you know it's good. This place has been open since 1989. Restaurants in Chicago don't last that long unless they're doing something right. Anybody else had Tenet's beer before? So, Duke of Perth is at. It's at 2913 Clark Street. My first apartment in Chicago is maybe 50 yards down that way when I used to live on Orchard. I lived in a studio. It was so tiny. I wish I wish I was making videos then because it uh, was an interesting place to live. There's a couple, there's some footage of it from number six with cheese. Mm, I've had this place before, but there's something about it just tastes extra good today. It's like extra crispy. Mmm, you know what it is? Well, the first time I did this was the number six with cheese. I like, took it to go, so it got steamed up in the to-go box. It's so much better if you eat it here. And you gotta come to this bar. It's like just such a classic looking spot. Like what you would imagine a Scottish bar would be like. Which by the way, this is another great little area in Chicago. And just south of here is where Clark, Diversity, and Broadway all meet. And it's just one of my favorite intersections in the city. It's just, like I was saying in the last place, just I love high energy places and there's just always a lot of foot traffic. A ton of good businesses around there. A lot a lot of great restaurants in this area. If you take Clark Street from here and go south, nothing but good restaurants. I was gonna say I gotta save some room for the next spot, but last bite. All right, we are headed to the Lark up in Boys Town, so let's cruise there. Another fun spot. Let's uh, let's cruise. Okay, so this place right here, this is Benny's. It's a like beer and liquor store. For my money, I mean, it's like built into a castle. For my money, that's the coolest place to get beer in Chicago. Benny's on Clark Street. Gotten me hammered many a times, Benny's, and I respect you for it. All right, we gotta, we gotta go eat some more fish. Let's go to Lark. Last spot of the day, guys. We're going to Lark. Gonna be some good fish here, I can feel it. So for this, we got some Pollock. Also did the classic lemon squeeze. We'll do a little bit of that. House-made tartar sauce and hush puppies. I haven't had hush puppies in so long. Super excited for it. All right. Mm, mm. Okay, two things. This homemade tartar sauce or house made is unreal. And Pollock, I maybe I just don't know about fish. This is huge. Compared to the other spots I was at today, which are all great, but this is a way like meteor fish. This is awesome. Mm, mm -hmm. mm, that's so good. Okay, I have to show you guys this real quick. How freaking awesome is this? Look at that. <laughs> Here, I gotta darken it a little bit so you guys can see that. Oh yeah, that's a glowing duck in my drink. <laughs> this is the duck duck mule. Oh, that is delicious. Oh, I'm about to slam this. I mean, how cool. All right, I gotta try these, uh, these hush puppies. Mmm, oh my god, that is so good. Okay, so this is probably super trash in me, but I think I've only ever had Long John Silver's Hush Puppies before. These are, I mean, obviously a thousand times better than that. That is that is a fire hush puppy. Lark's at 3441 North Halstead. In Boys Town, a lot of fun stuff. Not far from Wrigley, too. If you're coming to a, a baseball game, you can also come here and slam some food. 
It's just vibrant, great nightlife, tons of great bars, so many great restaurants. Oh, and this place, they do a, what do they call it? Hold on. Extreme bingo. <laughs> Which is basically, it's basically drag bingo. There's a drag queen who kind of runs the bingo show. Whenever uh, the number 69 gets pulled, it's like everyone does shots. But like, let's party, you know? <laughs> mm. Also these, the chips as they say over in the UK. French fries here, delicious. All right, this is the part of the day where I get bummed that I overate at every place before this because I want to keep eating this and I'm so stuffed because this is my third restaurant and I don't know what's been like two hours of me walking around. So, I gotta call it. If you've been watching this far, thank you so much. Don't forget to like the video. If you're not subscribed, please do. I'm doing this all the time. Go follow Lakeview Chamber of Commerce. And, um, yeah, doing these all the time. I'll see you guys next week. Peace.